Welcome back to another episode of You'll Love It Here podcast. We are your hosts, Kelly and Rudy. And today we have very two special guests, our besties. Our first guests ever on this so season. So kind of them to travel <laughs> all over here. Woo! W's in the chat, W's in the chat. <laughs> We call, you know we call you guys the cools behind yeah, the back? Yeah, the cools. That's what we refer to That's you guys your secret as. name. The cools. We, the, cools? the cools? Yeah, I'll be like, Rudy, where are you? She's like, what the cools? Like, oh, <laughs> makes why, sense. Why the extra S? The extra S. I don't know. Because it's multiple of The you. cools. All of you guys. That's what the group is called. Yeah. Mm, true, true. Anyways, nice. anyways, okay. So we got Mook, Cool Kicks Superstar. We got Mo Ali Cox, NFL Superstar. Cheers. <laughs> 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 okay. okay. Introduction. Cheers. Oh, what's we doing here, Corona? Guys, you guys, guys want to drink these or not? Please. I can't drink a brew right now. I got, I got to keep my vacation body ready. I don't, I don't drink beer. Oh, you guys are missing out. Cheers. Cheers to us. Corona, call peer us. Pressure, peer Sponsor pressure. us. DM us. <laughs> I'm easily peer pressure. <laughs> okay, so we're going to start off with the game. When can you drink? Because we're starting off with the yeah, game. Yeah, we when have to. If you get the answer wrong, you have to take a the shot. The sun's down. Oh, okay. See, look, it's setting the sun's down. down. Yeah. I set us up. Yeah, I got Casamigos over here. <laughs> Drinking game? No, oh, we're, we we're, not, we're not experienced yet. Okay. We have we have tequila and we have Hennessy and we have beer. And, and we, we have, have Corona wine. if you want to just chill vibes. I like tequila though. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay, so the game is basically. Oh, drink the Corona. <laughs> we're going to show you guys pictures of things that are like girl related items. And you guys are going to tell, tell us what they are and what they do. So you have to say what yeah. it is and what is it for. And if you get the answer wrong, you have to take a shot. I'm losing. What it could be used for is uh, is um, opinionated, though. Yeah, but no, but just one of it, one of their like uses. What is it supposed to be for? Yeah. Okay, ready? And oh God. we'll put the we'll put the things up on the screen so people. You First one. Work. What? <laughs> <laughs> you guys ever seen this? That is. Think a, hard. Think hard. It's like the thing you put in the shower and hang your keys on. Why would you put your keys in the shower? I don't know. I'm gonna just Who go ahead that? and um, I'm gonna go ahead and drink. So I'm gonna just go ahead. I feel like you guys would know this. I don't know what the I don't Are know what the hell that is. Are you guys serious? Hey. Never seen that. That's a rose toy. No. no. Okay. It's a little bit closer. Like, like a suction, like a manual suction. Yeah. It's supposed to go upside down. If that makes sense. It would be like this. Yeah. It it's should a, be. A nuva ring. No. No. It's not oh. nuva ring. Okay. It fail. should be like Bro, this. Drink. Tell us, what, tell us what it is. Before you fail, you have to drink. Drink. It's a diva cup. You like basically if you don't want to use a tampon. You put that in your vagina and it like, like it just holds it all holds the blood. The blood in your Yo, <laughs> you and we supposed to know that? You guys didn't know that? No. We're I've testing. Never, I've never seen that. If you are around women a lot, which you are, yeah, you should know these things. I, right. I have tampons and like makeup remover in my house. Should I add that? Oh, you yeah. I'm trying to be so good. Put it in your no, put it in a little basket. I don't think anybody like I. I mean, some people obviously use. Don't this, but don't I'm use like, don't use it at my house. I don't, that's just, that's I don't know. That's 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 how do you empty it? I never. I don't oh, even know. That's oh, no. nasty. Next. Just empty it on Mook's floor. Okay, these. That's for like eyelashes. Yeah, eyelashes. Yeah. yeah. Okay, great eyelash job, guys. Curler. Great job, great job. This like one. eyelash pluck. Ooh, that that's is. like the IUD. What is it? Yeah, oh, yes. that is IUD. Good job. Wait, what is it used for? What is it used for? I mean, don't it go in your box? And for what? <laughs> it's a breath control. Man, yeah. I got it yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's a breath control. Those that's are pasties. Put it on your, your boobs. Pasties. Yes. You guys are doing great now. It's nipple coverings. <laughs> so uh, as for BBLs. Yes, <laughs> guys. I'm so proud of it. I've been around the block, and I know that the name is called. Fire oh, joints when you curl your eyelashes, man. Not no, no, no. Man, that's the, I don't know. You the use fluff. Yeah. Like, use it for yeah. your eyelashes. Fresh, fresh, the fluff, fresh, the fluff. Fresh, 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 fresh. Oh, that is a um, butt plug. <laughs> <laughs> no? So makeup. Um, <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, yeah, so I don't know the exact term, <laughs> but it's the biggest makeup. butt plug I've ever seen in my life. For contour. Contour. Uh, All right. Beauty no. Yeah, I well, mean, it's yeah. for like foundation. Ba- baking. Beauty blender. That's no, not baking, not baking. Beauty blender. Okay. That's yeah, the the girls version of honey. Yeah. What's it called? <laughs> I don't know what pink it's called. Pink rabbit or something like that. A pink Does that panther. look like a rabbit to you? Pink panther. Pink, pink kitten. Pink pussy. <laughs> pink pussy cat. <laughs> <laughs> and it's a panther. pill though. It's a pill. It's basically the female version of honey. Okay. Oh. That is. I don't know what that is. Really? That's Let me just go ahead. That's kind of. Big some, drink, guys. It's like a machine with suction cups. I don't know what's going on. Women are. It's for like when you're pregnant. <laughs> Yeah. You put it on your stomach? No. <laughs> All right, I don't know then. Put it's me. a breast pump. Yeah. Oh, for baby. milk. Yeah, you, you literally you keep it on there. there all day long and are it just pu- sucks blood. Are you I'm at blood. Milk? It just sucks oh. milk. <laughs> and then the baby just, drinks it out that 
into a bottle. Oh, I get it. Hey, good. Because if you don't breastfeed, your boobs are exploding with milk just leaking out. Like so you dripping, have to dripping through your shirt. And yeah. All that. Yeah. If you're a good breastfeeder. Yeah, some, some women don't. don't. Generate that much I was breastfed. My mom breastfed me when I was younger. That's good. You're supposed good. to be smarter. And That's what I was about to say. You're a smart man. Just, well, I don't know. I don't know where he ain't smart. Yeah, very intelligent. <laughs> Today's podcast is brought to you by Mill Ticket Casting. Are you a bad bitch? Do you want to be in your favorite rapper or singer's music video? Well, you don't have to be a bad bitch. It's a plus if you are. But we cast men, women, children, grannies, dogs, cats, stunt people, <laughs> birds, and birds. <laughs> Anything. Birds. <laughs> Anything. Yeah, so if you want to get booked to be in a commercial or music video, fashion campaign, all of that, Mill Ticket has got you covered. Yes. Actors, influencers, sorry, I forgot to mention those. Dancers, anybody. We have so many jobs available. We post jobs every day on the Instagram page, Mill Ticket TV. So follow that page to keep up with all of our castings. And if you are interested in submitting for the jobs, please make a profile at millticketcasting.com. And that's where you can submit, get your money up, get your bread up, get booked, become a famous actor. It all starts at Mill Ticket. And if you didn't know, Mill Ticket is a casting agency that has worked with everyone from Drake to Justin Bieber and they will get you taken care of. Yeah. And <laughs> if you have, if yeah. you have a brand or a company or anything you'd like to advertise on this podcast, feel free to email me the information, Rudy at milltickentent.com or you can slide in our DMs on Instagram at you'll love it here pod. If we do go to my <laughs> academic um, success, uh, uh, master's degree, that's not the You story. have a master's degree? Yeah. In I'm, what? I'm very educated. In um, strategic public re- public relations. What is that? <laughs> <laughs> it's like mass communications, like, I don't know. I love you talk uh, to you about making this Making businesses work with other businesses. And I was mm. like, wow, I, like, I'm asleep on you when it comes to business shit because I feel like you just present yourself as a fun, like, guy, yeah. but you, like, know some stuff. Don't get it twisted. We are educated. Very educated. For sure. VCU's finest. No, I'm from Virginia, so... Oh yeah, we are. You big know, VA. You know, you know, you know school. Big VA. You know school, big VA school, shout out. school, big out there. School shoot out there. If you don't go to school, school you're, 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 you're a dweeb. Facts. Uh, Wait, for this next one, we need a, the clipboards. We do. Clipboards. Yeah. I thought they just point. Okay, good idea. Good idea. Oh, no, I don't clipboards? know where to put it. You I can put just it point. Away. They can just point. Yeah, okay. They can just point. Okay. This is like another game. This is yeah, yes. This is of. the last game. But who's more likely to basically? Oh. So I'm gonna say we're gonna say a statement. And you guys have to pick between each other. Who is more likely to do it? (laughs) Okay. Ready? Yeah. All right. First Uh, one. Who's more likely to let a girl sleep over multiple days in a row? (laughs) Lover boy. Okay. Who's more likely to be 40 and still in the club? (laughs) Together. (laughs) We'll both be there together. (laughs) Woo! Party boys. The honey pack in the Costa Rica ghost bottle. In Viagra. That's hilarious. (laughs) Viagra. No Viagra. <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. None of that. None of that. None when of it's that. all, when it's done, it's done. When it is done, it is done. I'm good. When it ain't working no more. Yeah, I'm not, not going to force it. I've had enough fun. When it's okay, time to go, it's time to go. Who's more likely to catch feelings? What? <laughs> nah, nah. I like, I like, I like, yeah, I catch feelings. I catch feelings a lot. I've never seen, i never seen Mo like boot up before. I've seen there. Mo boot up the other day. He keeps it low key. Oh. He keeps it low key. <laughs> Rare sightings. Caught feelings in a in two hours. Thought I was low. Three Thought hours. Thought she was low. Thought you was low. On Sunset Boulevard. You're in my neighborhood. <laughs> <laughs> it's a quick stop on the way home. Okay. Uh, Who was more likely to have a baby first? Mo. You seem like you would be a dad. You want to have a baby soon? I don't know. You're going to have a big-ass child. <laughs> <Are> you <scared? laughs> no. Unless she's small. That's right. true. They could be a small baby mama, I guess. I don't know. I'm the baby's one in my family. My parents are short, so. Yeah. Really? Well, my mom's short as hell. Powerful genes. How did that happen? Powerful genes. My dad's 6'3". So. No, my parents, yeah. My dad's <laughs> like 6'2". But I'm taller than my dad, though. I don't know how I... Yeah, I'm taller. I'm taller than I'm, both I'm, my parents. I, I ended up super tall, tall, too. I don't know how. We're all just rare as fuck. We're all from Virginia, and we're all just tall. <laughs> yeah. It's like great Greek. Lucky. Facts. <laughs> Blessed. Grateful. Phenomenal. <laughs> Phenomenal. <laughs> okay. Um, oh, who's more likely to lie? To lie? I don't know. It depends oh. what you're lying for. Just in general. I don't really lie. I, I, sometimes I won't, I won't omit the truth. Mm. Like lie to... Sounds like a lie to me. Like, yeah. like lie... I don't know. Just lie at all. 
I'm gonna go with me. Let me just say. Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll go. I'll go with me. Even <laughs> but, I don't know. Guys. We're nice. We're very nice I, people. I, I, I lie about oh. different things. Like, say someone wants to chill with me or something. Like, oh, yeah. I gotta go to the gym or do this. Even yeah. though I just want to be home by myself. Make yeah. up something. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Right. Yeah. Or like, like are you the- going out? <laughs> uh, maybe because I know you're trying to you bring don't want six of your people with you, or like I don't know. Those are both understandable things. Like that's one yeah. of the only things that I'll lie about is like. I just truly don't have an excuse to not hang out. I just don't feel like it, so I'll just say that I have. Yeah, something. you're a nice person. Like me yeah. saying I'm not here is a whole is a lie, and I say that in the camera <laughs> in front of you. That's your entire brand, right? <laughs> I'm not here in bed by twelve. It's cat. Okay. Very. Who's more likely to wife a whore accidentally or purposefully? Wife a whore. Wife her. Mm. I, I don't. I don't judge people, so probably me. I don't know. <laughs> We're not judgmental. <laughs> I don't know you. Whatever you did before me, it's it's, it's it happened. Well, Nothing it could happen me. during you though. Hey, anything could happen. True. Horror or angel. True. The wool people get. So we're going with Mook on that. He like wife a horror too. I mean, who's a what's a horror these days? You like no, know what a horror is. Come paid, on, let's be real. She get paid for sex. What? That, that's, that's a, a whole. Level, that's yeah. a horror. Yeah, but there's a different Shame levels. Yeah, going to get paid for sex is a horror. A person that has sex with a single is just single, maybe. I don't feel like that's a horror. I feel like a whore is just like someone who just like fucks literally everyone just that you if, know, yeah. and just be is just super passed around and just. Super I think it's just, like someone, a girl, who everyone's passed around, has though. sex with anyone, even if she doesn't really want to, just because guys just want. She thinks that's what guys want from her, so she just does it because they want like to do slut. it. So is Kim K a whore? Mm. I don't know her personal. Yeah, I don't know. Face. You know how many bodies she got though? I don't. I don't. No, we do. You, I don't I know for sure. I can name ten bodies. Yeah, yeah we know, know how many, but we don't know how many more. And I, and I don't know if she's just, like, horny or if she's just trying to show off. That's what I'm saying. I, like, if Kim K wanted me to wife her, if I get four to wife her, I would. That's an iconic one, though, so I get that. So, so iconic <laughs> means you could be more of a whore. <laughs> that's more that's what guys think. I guess, yeah. Uh, guys give a better, like, more lenient to people who are... They do. Right. Yeah, who have more clout. If you're popular, Like, me and Rudy get judged very ranger. harshly yeah. by guys. If we're even And seen, then they'll just go fuck with whoever because she's whoever. If and we're she's even literally seen fucked everybody somewhere the with anybody, then it's <laughs> like, like, oh... Yeah, literally. Guys will be like, oh, I seen you so, with so-and-so. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, like, okay, that. I can have a friend. Yeah, I don't think yeah. I've ever said that to a girl. Y'all but, are But we never know. Guys have double standards. No, guys have huge egos. That's the thing. Move like them, they'll say you're a whore. Like you could be in the club, you yeah, know, with literally. some random guy that you know. They gonna say you're a whore, even though they in the club with some random girl. Yeah, and they'll be like you just said, like if it's a popping girl, oh, but she's not ten of my friends. The rules don't apply. Yeah, the rules do not apply. Window, yeah. That's crazy. It's crazy. They it's hard out here. They do, but they don't. It just depends. Yeah, it depends who you are. No niggas, niggas yeah. love clout though. That's the that's the end of the day. Like that's what it is. It's clout. possibly maybe. Depends. Do you guys We're gonna ever say. see yourself getting married soon? Ever? Yes, I'm trying yes. to find. I'm trying to find love ASAP. Honestly. Really? I need romance. I like romance. <laughs> so, <laughs> I how just so how long? Really? How long do you? I think? don't see that. What's yes. your cutoff date to begin married? A cutoff date? I probably got like two more years, man. I'm yeah. trying to find the romance what? now. So I can build Not married it. in two years. Not stable like, relationship. Find stable relationship. Okay. Yeah, find next, someone you would next summer. Be. Hopefully, we we're on vacation and we experience the summer together with each other really? instead of like. And you're like, this is it. Yeah, but we do you might, feel like that's if you possible can make it through the, If you can make it through the summer, you're a real one. <laughs> you can make if you it. can make it living in LA though. Like I feel like it's harder make, here. You can make it living in LA. You think you can get married living here? Yeah. You guys, you're gonna stay here. With well, me, I'm going back home. I'm going back to VA. Really? I might go, back, I might go yes. to the other side. You can store. go anywhere, Mo. Why would you go back to Virginia? Right. I mean, Virginia is like, school systems. Yeah, just my children. Yeah, Northern Virginia school systems. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Great place to raise a family. Great place. A lot of space. Quiet. Not too, not too pricey. The food, it's pricey, but not too, too pricey. Not too pricey. DC is expensive as well. Not DC. I'm not living in DC. Okay. I'm living in Northern Virginia. Okay. <laughs> Northern Virginia. No, no. It's one of the richest areas. I mean, yeah. is the most. One of them is yeah. the most. But you can find, you can find, you can find good stuff there. Yeah, yeah. It's nice, but LA it's just still expensive. Too, LA too. Uh, I mean, I'm in LA now. I've been in LA what six, seven years now. I want to sure. live in. I I wanna if you can live here, you can live. But anywhere. if I live here, I'll move like out towards like Thousand Oaks area or something like. You guys live in the cut already. Yeah. We do actually. But like I will live there. I, I, would, I would live in that neighborhood. Yeah. I live in now. Like, really? Right. You guys like you raise a family in that neighborhood? Yeah. yeah. You guys have the family friendly that, neighborhood. That neighborhood is super quiet. Super quiet. We what? Me and Diana and um, Aisha were walking the baby the other day. I tried, not the other day, like a month ago, and I walked past your guys' house and I tried to call you. Nobody answered. Where were we there? No service. I don't know. We in the mountains. We in the mountains. Just knock on the door. It's a safe place. This is why we talk yeah. about lies. We in the doorbell. What? Yes. You ain't it's in the mountains. She did text me, and I don't think it was oh, gone. Oh, so you ain't hear me. I think it was gone. I think you were in the season. Always hungover. 
was not was probably hung over the day before. You, you, nights, you probably were. Yeah. You probably were. <laughs> like a god alone <laughs> and drink alone. I make, I make it to the gym. That's yeah, sad. You're right. You're right. Sad. <laughs> Oh, I gotta go to the gym, man. What's that? It's not my occupation. Did you, guys, did you guys know oh. each other in high school or you met in college? In college. Early in college. Hmm. And then you were like, let's be besties. We're in the same like, dorm. Like, same really? Dorm. Really? Same That's dorm. That's so cute. Wait, did you live in the athlete dorm? Yeah. yeah. And he lived but there too? Some, what did you some do? Um, regular students could live regular there. Regular students could oh. live there. Yeah, it was the, they oh. had their own floor, like one area, but some regular students. All the athletes in there, like a few students that wanted to live there that could get approved to live there. Mm. I'm an athlete though. I you know I committed you. to VCU out of high school? You did? Yeah. And then I decommitted. You went to ODU and you went to the rival? No, I went to Hofstra first. Oh, you did go to Hofstra first. Because I wanted to like get out of Virginia. And then I came back came anyway back. and went to ODU. You missed home? Yeah. Missed home. You went to Norfolk. Norfolk week. Monarchs. Yeah. We're a big rivalry right here. <laughs> ODU's live, actually, though. Yeah, yeah we go, both went to, to ODU. ODU. I never had fun at ODU. Really? Nah. Okay, me and Kelly. I used to visit VCU all the time. I never but I ran, but like I was a big man on campus at VCU. So yeah, I, just I was. I had no reason. I had no reason to leave. VCU's like, why? king. <laughs> VCU's. What is he doing? What is the thing? Huh? Is VCU's king. Is king. Me and Kelly weren't that close in college because I feel like she was like <laughs> didn't like go to you. She thought no, it was I lame, yeah. and I was like, oh, that's some of my life. Yeah. And Kelly's like in DC, like oh my god, oh, do you so uh, yeah. feel like going out girls bar on the weekends? Oh, and I was, opera. Yeah. Yeah. Yourself. Yeah. Opera Friday. No, it wasn't was even that. Bars at ODU. <laughs> no, like, it wasn't. Woo! It wasn't even that. I just felt older. I don't know why. I don't know why. I like it. I just didn't like going out at those fucking bars. I never had fun. I, I would drive to ODU. I mean, I would drive to DC and come back for practice in the morning at like six a.m. I think it's because I'm from like savage. Yeah, savage. <laughs> I'm from like. But I had country. a guy. I had a guy in DC. Three hours. I'm from the country, and I never like. I wasn't going out in DC when I was young. Yeah. I wasn't. I wasn't going out at all. Like I was going to barn parties and shit like that. Right. And then I went Drinking to college. Moonshine? Yes. <laughs> Literally on fires. Bought, yeah, I'm not kidding. That's all I ever did. Like I never went out in DC at all. And I turned 18 and went to college. And so the college bars was like, whoa. It's oh, dude, that's how VCU lit. was. A lot of people from VCU, it's like the same. They come there and see bars and think they're in school though. Yeah. People are from everywhere. It's everywhere. one of the most diverse colleges in the state. If and not, really? If not the most diverse. Maybe number one, honestly. I wish I went to I, VCU is my top choice, but I was too scared to go alone. To VCU? Yeah. I went alone. Scary ass. Because I was from the country. ODU's, I feel like, a better ride for you, though. Yeah, it was. You're right. It's ODU's like, it. yeah. I, love I wanted to be in the hour. city, though. Activity hour was lit. So. I used to go down there to activity hour. Like, that shit was <laughs> like lit. I went there. Yeah. We could never go though. Like our oh, coach yeah, was just fucking the best psychotic. Place. Yeah. We could never go to that yeah, shit. That shit is fun as fuck. Huh? I, I had a so crush on one of team. Y'all were on lockdown. Yeah, what? Oh, we were on OD lockdown. Where you going nowhere? We had nowhere. We had curf. We had to get our phones taken on home games. Man, one year I had what? class during winter I break. I swear to God. <laughs> They used to come oh, around no, no, and take no, our no, phones no, on home had, games. They didn't take our phones. Lucky I had, I had another phone and an iPad and a laptop. They made us delete Twitter. I didn't have Twitter. Yeah, I had to delete Instagram. I didn't have Instagram for two years. What? Yes. I had it, but I didn't post nothing. So I wasn't getting no know, DMs. I didn't know college sports was like, uh. It's not. Well, it's, it's it depends so, on the coach. It depends because we had dudes on our team tweeting like crazy shit. Like, oh, really? <laughs> so coach was like, none of y'all can have it. <laughs> like, yeah. they, it was like the year before I got there. He said, Coach Smart put it like a presentation, pulling up everybody's tweets. All the oh, savage yeah. shit they were tweeting. And so, it ruined it for the rest My of the Michael's just a hater. Crazy. It was cool, though. Honestly, it kept me out of trouble because you know how they pull up your old ass tweets? I probably yeah. said, I probably They put them in class like for me shit. one time. I'm a mass comm class. They used to make an example of me. Like, if you, want, <laughs> if you want to get like a job, don't act like this. They used to put my tweets on the screen. What? My party, me and party pictures. Parties. Yeah. Look at you now. <laughs> Look at you now. Exactly. Entrepreneur. Forget all Kelly got these for my birthday at your store. Oh, legendary. Mm-hmm. You like the taste. Huh? Anybody yeah. else saw those? Yeah, oh, we got so everything cute. there now, man. I was so impressed. Yeah, well, I was choice. like, I got these. I was like, bam, I'm coming. We got, I'm on the we way. Got everything in there. Cool Kicks LA, check us out. Yeah. Add add. So how did Cool Kicks even begin? We like you said the cools. We used to yeah, call the cools. The cool lovers, like a group. The cool lovers. Like cool. cool. We used to, merch. Yeah, the cool was just a random our group name. Oh, Instagram. okay. Okay. We had nothing. We just used to, used do to you go know? Out. Do you know what cool stands for? No. no. Korean art only. Oh. It's a real real thing. And 4017 Wow, is, very interesting. <laughs> How have you known you guys this whole time is, and never knew Y'all that? never knew that? No. <laughs> That's what I mean. And then the, the number is the dorm room of BK, Marcus, Ben. Aw. Exactly. He's living in that dorm room. We was a young boy, so we used to go hang out there. And then uh, we used to throw parties. Me and Adele and BK used to throw parties. Then we got popular. And then uh, 
Roger came. We linked up Roger. Roger knew Mo. Mo was red shirt year, so we all clicked up. No, who? I used to kick it with a deal. A deal lived. A deal lived down the hall from me. <laughs> Always sent me up for basketball tickets. You got tickets? You got tickets? And then it was like St. Patty's Day. Oh, Shamrock the Block. We love St. Patty's Day. Shamrock the Block. Shamrock Dude, the that's Block. When we, that's when I really got cool with him. Me and Roger used to just hang out every day after that. You know, you buy mm. Mutual interest. We not, we not, we not know. losers to nobody. We all hustling. So you guys never had a fallout ever with the friendship? No. No. Nah, we not worried Really? That. that is so crazy. Like, how do guys stay friends for so long? People be like, like y'all been friends for over 10 years Has anyone like, ever, <laughs> has any of the cools ever fought each other like? No, we have like beefs and like, like little differences, but we communicated though. Hmm. Like we have a group That's chat. Very we rare. talk to each other. We have, but we have like, peace on people in our crew that will eliminate the awkwardness to figure it out. Like, mm. right, if you're awkward to each other, just joke it. Yeah, just joke, just joke on the it. Whole joint. Y'all never had a physical fight, like drunk mm. or anything never. like that. Nah, nah. <laughs> really? That's so if you guys dated the same girl, would you guys fall out? Dated the same girl? No. No one's gonna go date the same girl though. Uh, Not too, too close. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sure y'all have messed with a lot of the same girls. Yeah, we hooked up with. I mean. Hey, people are free to do to choose whoever they choose, <laughs> whatever the the season is, whatever the weather is, <laughs> whatever, <laughs> whatever time, whoever you choose for the day or the month or the, that weekend, it's all hmm. good. We're not tripping. You know what's crazy? Um, not tripping at all. We before this, we were gonna start a podcast. We've been wanting to start a podcast, and I was like, we're trying to think of a name, and I was like, I think we should do call it the coolest podcast in the world. I even have mm. a TikTok account. It's called Coolest Podcast. So we and then name? y'all fucking start a podcast <laughs> and said coolest podcast in the world. I was like, what? The? I mean, I guess it goes with you guys. It, it was, say it that, it was goes called, with the brand. Yeah, it was called kicking it with the cool at first. And then, I like and that you one. Still my name. And then we changed it to kicking. It, no, it's not called the coolest podcast, podcast in the world. Okay, well, it's called kicking my, it with cool kicks. We just say it like at my, an intro. My slogan. Theirs makes more sense though. I know it goes. Thing, with it worked. Everything worked out. I said it first. We got it from Rudy. We got it from Rudy. We will credit you the next episode. Of cookies, name podcast. at the end of the credits. <laughs> Fine print. Your real name. <laughs> Do y'all know Rudy's real name on this channel? It's pretty know it. On the last episode, we literally just I did a quiz and said, "Do you know my real name?" And we wrote it and put it on the screen. So now they know it. Nobody would have got it right. Bro, I had to book a flight for Rudy. Fundi. Remember, I had to book a flight for Rudy, and they wouldn't let her get on because I, I put missed. Rudy Jackson instead oh, of her full name. Damn. I missed the fucking flight because and they couldn't get on. Let you on? Nah, but they let you get on to Vegas, but not from Vegas. Huh? That's your friend? Yeah, you gotta do better. I honestly had no <laughs> idea that that, like, I had I know, no idea I've done that. that before, and they never caused a problem. It was just this one day, they fucking fucked me up. Ran into that ass. What's my, exactly. What's it my, depends on the person. What's my full, full name, though? It's First and last. Funde Miss Jackson? I don't know. <laughs> what does Jackson come from? Is that your last name at all? <laughs> what's the middle? What's the middle one? Rudy. Yes. Jackson. And? And something else. Donnelly. I have two last names. Donnelly. She, I don't I feel like they would know, 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 know I ain't know the Donnelly. Damn. No, I knew it, but how the fuck was I supposed to know that? How you go full day to Donnelly? Do Donnelly like such a... Irish. That's so crazy. <laughs> <laughs> well, every, all my friends know my, my real name, and we keep that tucked, though. Yeah, but. I just found it out recently, I think. Oh, who told you? You did, I think. I did? Yeah. I fuck with you, though. Right. No, you asked me what his real name was. Yeah, Remember when you were doing this? But you told me it, and now I forget what it was. That's all good, then. When we were drunk. Oh, yeah, you yeah, forgot yeah. what it was. But yeah. you were like, damn, right. what's his real name again? When we were I didn't tell you. I forgot already? Does she doesn't know. I don't know. But uh, she doesn't know either. I'll tell you at the end. Does your conclusion? Your family calls you Mookie, don't they? Mookie. Mookie. Mookie, Mookie, Mookie. That's how I got my name. My wife pushed my cheeks. Your family gave you that? And then, my, and then I moved to Virginia, to the hood, and they said, we're going to call you Mookie. 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 They were like, we're not calling you ain't fucking no Mookie. Ain't no grown man calling you Mookie. <laughs> Whatever they call you Mookie said. I There's said, a real Mookie in the world, though, isn't there? Mookie Betts. Yeah. They, they call him player. Mookie. But that's his name. That's his real name. Are you remember. serious? <laughs> yes. But they call him that. Actually, I don't know if that's his real name, but. Yeah, who knows? That might be a nickname, too. Like, Literally all over TV, that's what they call him. So yeah. I gotta fact check that. Literally. Yeah, is that his real name? I don't know. Okay, do you guys feel like living in LA changed you at all? Changed me? Nah. No. Nah. I feel like I'm the exact same person. Really? I got a little more money. Like, no one from at home says, like, oh, y'all Hollywood now because y'all just. I mean, they can say that. They don't say we Hollywood. We go back to Richmond, and it's all still love. They don't be like, it's more like we're proud of you instead of like, mm, that's good. Y'all change. Y'all I still weird. talk to everybody. Yeah. Yeah. You, you don't have as much time to hang out with people. But I think people interpret that as we Hollywood. Like, yeah. Because yeah, but like, plenty of people have said that's me. I people feel. say that's me all the time. Yeah. Like just because I live here, I'm like, huh? Yeah, yeah. Because I don't. Oh, they be like, they be like, oh, you big time, big money, yeah, exactly. da, da, da. But it's like that's so weird to say. Just but, live but, in a city. 
like then they come out here and see like Holly LA Hollywood is not what the movies make it to seem mm-hmm. like. Yeah. Like it movies may seem like it's all glitz and glamour. You walk exactly. around downtown, you walk around Hollywood, it's not as clean as how the movies and different things like that. Like my friends just came there like they saw the the stars, the words yeah. it, Walker, whatever. People walk away. They were like, What the hell is this? Like, Literally. What the f- like they were like so distraught. No, like, it's disgusting. People always <laughs> get shocked by that. Like it's I brought my mom there and, and it's just like I'm like, yeah, this is a tourist. This, I'm like, this is a tourist area. A million people walk this street. It is not gonna be clean. And no. that's the last place you ever want to visit <laughs> in LA. Exactly. <laughs> but that's like any major city. Like the the main place you wanna go is not as like Times Square in New York is dirty too. I like Times Square though. It's a nice little vibe. It's still it's dirty, vibe. but it's Hollywood vibe. Boulevard is a vibe too. No, it's not. No. <laughs> Times Square is not nice. Oh, do I nothing like on Hollywood Square. Boulevard. Ew. Times Square is the same. It's but it's like at least like a magical like look uh, around. Higher the buildings. Nice. There's yeah. nothing to see on Hollywood. Boulevard. I feel like that's, that's New York in general though. Like anywhere you go, it's nice yeah, buildings. Yeah, that's true. So. Yeah, it's dirty. Though. Nice buildings and big rats. Yeah, New York's dirty. I like New York. New York. Not Times Square. That would be the dirty. But I like New York. <laughs> like Soho. I don't see no rats out here, but New Ever. York. You do? You I don't? don't. I've seen rats out here. I've seen rats in Hollywood. I said I have. Hollywood? I have On Melrose. Oh, really? you have? Yeah. Ew. Damn. I don't know what part of Melrose I see those right. nasty ass cockroaches <laughs> on Hollywood Boulevard, though. Hell yeah. Ew. Me and Kelly always. Um, what the fuck is I about to say? LA, LA is uh-uh. it's kind of dirty. Yes. I mean, kind of only dirty. I mean no downtown. only one downtown and Hollywood Boulevard. Yeah. Everywhere else is nice. Yeah, you're right. Like West right. Hollywood, that little yeah, fucking West, gave, West the neighborhood. Cool. That's we, nice. WeHo. Yeah, WeHo. That's the cleanest oh. place in LA. Mm-hmm. I remember what I was gonna say. Um, me and Kelly always say like, when, do you guys have this problem when we go home or we hang out with like our family or like friends from other places that don't live around here? And it's like. You just say, like, oh, yeah, blah, 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 so-and-so, like, talking about a celebrity. You know what I'm saying? Just in a way of, like, oh, uh, oh yeah. the baby stopped by the store the other day. And they're like, oh, like, yeah, oh yeah, my yeah. God. And it's like, bro, like, it makes me feel like I can't talk about anything in my life without sounding like I'm, like, trying to brag or something. And I'm like, I'm not weird. saying that in a way, that, but, but to those people, it sounds, like, so crazy. But I'm like, that's literally... Yeah, you gotta understand that those people are still celebrities in them. You see them more often yeah. because you have access to them, but they're still celebrities. Like, so... If but you, it is a cringe conversation mm-hmm. to have. Because like. yeah. to us, it's regular. Yeah, you don't want to Living here, you're literally running into yeah. who's who every day. See, yeah, like sometimes any I don't moment. say stuff. Yeah, I don't even really say half the stuff that goes I'll, on. I, just, I, don't, yeah, yeah, I don't even, bring, either, I don't even bring it up. I'm just scared. I'm like, ugh. I try to stay silent because I feel like every time I talk, I'm like saying something. And, but it's hard because people are like, oh, how's, what do you do for yeah. your job? Like, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, exactly. What do you, like, yeah. And it's like I constantly something has to do with something like that. And then, and then I just feel like I'm like. Especially like working at Interscope, they're like, do you guys work with celebrities? I'm yeah. like, they tr- that they is my whole <laughs> job like, yeah. is to work with celebrities. Yeah. I'm like, I don't even know where to go with this. Like, yeah, it's hard do to you talk. guys yeah. meet this this person? I'm like, right, I who? literally, I don't want to talk about this They're anymore. Like, who have it's, you met? Yeah, exactly. Who do you It's becoming like, way uh, too fucking <laughs> awkward now. I'm like, uh, ending conversation. You gotta take pictures every time and just show them. Yeah, like, just let them see on Instagram. I would never do that. No. Cool no, I'm, I'm joking. I cannot do that. <laughs> I'm not being serious. And that's the thing, yeah, we never post that. Exactly, there's no proof. Yeah. But, just because it's everyday life for my job, you know what I'm right. saying? There's no proof. I'm not posting on my Instagram. But I'm they, like, they don't need to know. Yeah, exactly. Honestly. Sometimes people don't need to know. Yeah, just yeah. Keep, keep it to your chest. You know, you so look many, good. Exactly. There's also so many people in LA that do that are the opposite of exactly. that, and they're like, they're like, oh yeah, music video comes on. Like, oh yeah, it's Jeffrey talking about young stuff. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh Jeffrey. He's so you know how many cool. times we had we were like had vibes at the crib and we watching YouTube videos and the girls <laughs> she's in it. Like, she has, a, she has, her. she has her story about it. Now nah, she'll be there sitting watching her video, and she has her, you know, her secret story about what happened on set. Like Aubrey was just like so. Yeah, stuff like that. <laughs> yeah, he, oh, he texted. He asked me to text him after. He just texted, like, me, he just texted he went to me yesterday. Actually, fish. I kind of believe that though. I saw I seen Drake sliding some DMs. Yeah, one hundred percent. Everybody does. Yeah. Happens. Sure. Happens. Everybody does that. Yeah, but I think I think well, a lot y'all, of girls. Y'all be, y'all be sliding DMs. Y'all be sliding. We no. signed in DMs. I slid in someone's DMs. Oh yeah, you did. What happened? Oh One yeah, one of the first times. What's, what's the? Um, he forgot to. He forgot to. What's the conclusion? No reply. He just didn't seem enthusiastic with the reply. And back. we, our theory is that he just like forgot to be enthusiastic. Like his, he would try in his head, but he just forgot. He was nervous. So if you're you delusional, you'll never be rejected. He was, oh. he was nervous. He was too nervous. He was too nervous. nervous for her. Yeah, he was too excited that he just. 
He has the nerves for pretty girls, so you gotta, you gotta you gotta allow him not to be nervous. He You're liked my pictures before, and I came across this page again, and I I said something like, "Oh, I like your videos, like they're cool." And then he was like, "Thank Thanks. you," with a heart or something. Yeah, that's I was cool. like, "Oh, which one is he should have been like, thank you. What's up? Where do you live? Where so I can come near you?" He was liking my pictures before this, so I'm like, "Where do you reside, Queen?" It's Instagram. That's what it's. But I'm supposed to like pictures. No, no, no. If you like pick three pictures in a row is the max. You clearly want me to notice you, so I like three pictures in a row and then we exchange DMs. Oh, that's how it goes? Yeah. All right. I don't see it like that. I'm opening up the what? avenue. You don't see it like that? that that's, how, that's how it goes? I think so. Like three goes. photos or if you like three photos then I shoot the message. If you like one photo, it's What's like, the point okay, of that? I'm whatever. like, okay, that I don't doesn't care mean about anything. this. Two mm -hmm. or more, then I'm like, okay. But if I, I, if I like a guy more than, if I like any pictures of a guy that I don't follow, that's me saying, I'm shooting my why, shot. Why can't you continue the message? Just DM him and continue the Yeah, message. she did. But I feel like she's like, no. I was shocked that you did that. I shot my shot. Yeah. And he just wasn't enthusiastic. So if you see this. Yeah, <laughs> sir. <laughs> How about you just reply then? Like, do you double text, double DM? Is that a no? Is that no, that's double insane. DM is crazy. Single DM, DMing crazy. is crazy in general. What? So that's why double DM is crazy. As a girl, I'm saying. No, yeah. it's not. I've only DM'd one not. time, I think, and that was because he was watching my story continuously and liking my picture. So I'm like, did you like what you see? Did you find what you're looking at? Like, why do girls think one DM is even crazy? Yeah. Because it's like y'all are supposed to. Men are just naturally like hunters. You know what I'm saying? So it's like they what? want something. If you like what you like, but if they want something, I feel like they're gonna try to. Talk to you. You miss a hundred percent of the shots you're gonna take. That's just but I'm not afraid to shoot my shot. In person, I'm not gonna shoot my shot, but I'll put energy out there. In so person, you can shoot me your shot. shooting my shot in person is me just staring really at hard you. at you. Yeah, exactly. Look yeah, at your eyes. What's a guy that's used to that? Smile. You gotta do a little more, maybe. No. Yes. Um, yeah. I think they like it. It's clear. It's worked every but time. But at least it's clear. And so I'm like, okay, if I'm looking, and I'm smiling. I'm hundred percent from the field so far. Yeah. Exactly. Come talk to me. Yeah. You're not shooting enough shots. True. <laughs> but it I'm works. putting the energy out there. It works. <laughs> That's the same thing, though. It works pretty much 100% every time. two for two is not as good as going 20 for True. 28. To me, it works every time. And if it, it does, does work every if time. If it doesn't work, I assume they have a girlfriend. Yeah, I assume that or they're blind. You, or you assume they have blind. a girlfriend? What? Blind. Like, blind gay girlfriend. girlfriend. Blind gay girlfriend. <laughs> Damn, blind. What, what, if, what if they just, uh, what you express a little more interest? Because they don't want to be, they don't want to jump again. Because a lot of guys know if a girl's, Feels that you're too thirsty, you already lose. So, mm. but you're not. Nah, look at this thirsty ass. Like, yeah, exactly. True, true. I'm but just trying not, to be nice. If I'm looking at you and flirting with you with my face, you're not thirsty if you come talk to me. You're thirsty if you if you are chasing me down the street. Yeah. Like, hey, 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 little mama. Like, yeah. yeah. Hey, but it was like mama. today. It happened to us when right. we walked out here. That's thirsty. And if I'm yeah. if I'm denying right. you and then you continue and you can't read the body language and you keep pushing it, then you're thirsty. Yeah, but also I don't like when you're like looking at someone and then they go home and DM you. Like you could have just oh, said something. Bro, right. I'm like, really I'm, shy. Some guys are really, really shy. I'm like, I'm right here, bro. Ninety percent. Or airdrop your number to me or something. Yeah. Hey, creative. that's just funny. I've seen that happen. <laughs> it's been in, in, all um, the time. Like, no, that happens all the time. Yeah. The no talk and DM. I see that happen. Yeah, I see it happen. But some guys are. But also, shy. they probably don't want people in their business. Like they don't want to come up to you in front of a bunch of people yeah, like, and like oh. exchange numbers and then like a bunch of people see. You know? Like I saw so and so. Exactly. Talking to so and so. Yeah, that's why I'm I'm like, I get that. I rarely exchange numbers. Yeah, what Instagram. do you do? Snapchat. Like, What's your Instagram? Yeah, I'm not gonna I don't follow you. Either. Yeah. Instagram. I read the Instagram. I mm. communicate more through Instagram than I do with text. Yeah. Unless I fuck with you and we Instagram's FaceTime. like texting. <laughs> yeah, same thing. Mm. <laughs> same thing. You I open an app boy as much. So it's not. You, yes, face, it is. you FaceTime bitches on Instagram. If a guy comes up to oh, me and asks my like, Instagram, yeah. I'm like, oh. That before. Sometimes girls will feel more comfortable giving you their Instagram than their number. I, I do that to people I don't like. Yeah. yeah. If I don't like you, I'm like, oh, you can take my Instagram. All right. And that's enough. And then it's up to the man to find a way to. Yeah. To get your That's what I'm saying. At least you have access to me in some type of way. True. Like, I would rather that than nothing. Exactly. That's not a matter. I really don't get anyone's phone number ever. What? Whoa. <laughs> That's insane. I like, I, Instagram is better. Like, I'm a, I That's look at your photos. Insane. I'm talking to you. I can remember you. You cross my mind. You post on your story. Phone number is like, it got to be real. I'm a, I don't know. It takes a while to get to that it phone It does number. have to be a, mem really? a memorable person, though, because if I just get a random person's number somewhere, I'm, and they text me like, hey, this is Joseph. You might forget. And like, then I the might the not fuck? talk the rest of the time. Yeah, that. you might not forget that. <laughs> I'm like, who the fuck is Joseph? And who is this is offensive now to, the, to people. I don't I care. I'm the king of who I is. say who is this. Who is this? Not new foe. Who is this? Just, don't remember I me? Don't nah. No. No, I say who is this, too. And then they say Joseph. I'm like, who is that? I don't have no idea who that is. Joseph who? Joseph Johnson, I've never heard of you in my life. Joseph Jackson. <laughs> I don't know who that is. I do, have, I, do have a, I do have a life hack for that. If you get someone number, you don't know who they are. You just cash app, cash app, the snap, the snap app. Yeah, I mean, Snapchat, Snapchat, snap app. or cash app. <laughs> <Snapchat. laughs> 
or I like Snapchat because I'm like, damn, they don't got no Snapchat. Fuck. Cash App. Cash App is good. Cash App works. I learned that. That's a stalking way. That's a new one. I ain't never done that one. But you can also catch bitches in the act, go in their phone and say, who the fuck is this? Text them. And they put in Cash App and you figure out. Remember when I learned the Cash App thing? I don't do that. I don't do that. Whatever she got going on her phone is her business. Yeah. Mm. Well, y'all go through phones. No, I have like twice. You looking for trouble? You found it. I found it. Yeah, and I you're always it. gonna find it. <laughs> I ignored it but both times. I didn't. Yeah. You're always it. gonna find it though. I didn't say anything. I, I That's why I don't do it. Five seconds later, I was like, "Stop, Rudy." I was like, put, I, "I was like, <laughs> yeah, stop, just stop." You don't I started see it. and, and I literally you have to save to yourself. Left. I was like, "I can't do this" because I'm like, "I know I'm not about to." Break up with this person, so I'm like, let me just not even look. Yeah, up. you don't need to see. Yeah. Some, some things are better left. You literally need oh, no. to save yourself and just not. I ain't up. never gone through a phone before. Never. Really? I can't. It's painful. My man code is too strong. <laughs> even though I know the facts, I'm like, my man, my man card is too strong to go through a phone. It's one of the most painful experiences you ever <laughs> I'm had. Good. I'm cool. <laughs> oh, cool. I can't go through a phone. Okay, not doing no, it. Yeah, drop no names. I'm just, I'm like oblivious. Yeah, I'll look away situation. in the open Instagram. I'm looking Close away. Close your eyes. <laughs> I'm legally blind, bitch. <laughs> I'm I wish everybody away. was legally blind. Just Honestly. Like it's better just as not. It is better. It's yeah. just better to protect your peace. Yeah, it's better. Like, I think my thing is like once you go through the phone, it's like, why are you going through the phone? There's no trust. Yes, yeah, already. No the trust factor is gone. But it's also like every time I ever have done it, I was right. Right. So that means that your intuition There's knew that this is. There's a reason why I didn't trust. Literally. Your hunch yeah. is just off anyway. Even if you ask to or want to, it's over. You don't trust me. All right, what, yeah. if, what if you went through it, didn't found nothing, and he found out you went through it? It's yeah. like, damn. That's, that's, he can't find I will, out. He I will, can I will, never I will, find out. I might, yeah, I might not. I'm no, not I, like, told, damn. I told <laughs> I told the person. Why do guys get so mad about that? I feel like girls what? are more lean there. Why are you guys going through I, my phone? <laughs> yeah, because I mean, guys could be like, you know, wilding. It's easy True. for guys to wild, and I'm not. And you think I am? So I'm like, damn. Even if you're not True. wild and girls be taking little stuff personal. Yeah. You be in a group chat, damn, she looked good as shit last night. Even <laughs> though, is that I'll cheating? Be, <laughs> no. No, yeah. But I, but I know some girls that. who would get mad would over get mad. you saying that. Yeah, I don't that. think I'll be mad about that. <laughs> I think my main concern if a guy goes through my phone is not even the other guys I'm texting, but the group chats. The group chats are yeah, crazy. Like me and Kelly's messages. Yeah. or Because we're probably not... Only we're probably saying wild shit about that guy. Yeah, we're probably making fun. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. We're probably like we. <laughs> we're probably like you see his outfit last night. Bro, like, you know what I mean? Like <laughs> every time you're with a guy. Well, not every time, but like we're always talking shit. Right. Yeah, that's how and it so goes. I'm like, but it's, it's no hard here. feel. Like it's not like I really am dead ass. Like I don't. You know what I'm saying? It's just like they're like, oh, that was so cringe. Yeah, so yeah. Like, fine, oh yeah. my god, last night he said this, and I was like, ew, disgusting. Yeah. Ick. You know what I mean? Yeah. But <laughs> it was it's like I'm still gonna talk to you, but it's just it's. Icky, what you did. Yeah. Like if a girl, if, if a girl wants to go through our phone, I always stress like uh, you can see it. Just don't go through my group chat because we have some kind of personal information in there True. that you don't, you don't need to know. And you it's like, like all the girls her covered. stuff is in my messages and right. my stuff's in here. Your messages. business yeah. is my phone, exactly. That's the main thing. Other people's business is my yeah. phone. Yeah, you don't do that. Your back is hurting over here. Oh. <laughs> I'm laying on the wall. Hell yeah. Posture, I won't be posture. like posture check. Posture, posture. <laughs> Just, I'm take a third back a little bit. That's Take a 30. Have y'all ever been um, catfish? Catfish? I get catfish. I mean, people catfish every day. Instagram has them. So many filters. What? We're talking about that today. But like, uh, so like an OD one, like where you're like, like oh, Like you met her and you were like, oh my God. Like OD catfish? Oh, um, maybe. Nah, she, nothing too OD. Not too OD. Nah, I mean, I know. But she, definitely happen. Like, invite them, say we all going out. Yeah, come pull up on us tonight. Come out like. It's like, oh, she's like that. What? <laughs> nah. Really? Yeah, that's how I don't be like, let me see your friend. Most guys would be like, oh, let me show see me your friends. friend, send me a scan. That's kind of weird to the that girl. That's weird as fuck. But I'll be like, uh, who you bring away? I need names for their tables. <laughs> then I go to her following, look at the names. And you find them. And, and we I do a lot of digging before. No, that's smart though, because yeah, girls will get offended if you say that sometimes. Yeah, I don't want to be weird. Like, even but you if, do even gotta if she, know. You yeah, gotta even know. if she's weird. I don't know who's gonna be around me. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I want to know who's around me. If she, even if she's weak, then I mean, unless, still it's, come, unless but. it's someone that you like know well, like you know, I'm not about to bring no crazy looking. Yeah, you know we, what I'm yeah, saying? I've never brought no crazy looking bitches around. But if it's someone you just met, you never know they could bring a freaking. You never know. Someone. Girls want to eat, and their friend wants to join them and eat and go out <laughs> for free. <So laughs> it happens. <laughs> happens. They, she could come. We're not like that though. We're not like mean or critical. But hey, she could go over there, but no one's really gonna pay her as much attention. Yeah. <laughs> Aw, poor girl. It's like, someone might, though. We got friends that like... That's what I was going to say. Y'all, like, not, not all y'all is perfect. Not all <laughs> yeah, your yeah, entire yeah. group. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we got some friends. <laughs> like. That's not every, every guy. Not all y'all is perfect. <laughs> hey, it, it's a tea. Someone got to do the dirty work. Always. Someone's got to do the dirty work. How about a trick on that? <laughs> 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 
It's the way she. It's the way, it's the way she said that, Georgia. Oh we, we, got, we, got, we got a well-rounded group, though. I'm fucking dead. I've seen. Though. I've seen groups. So got Everybody it. thinks that, though. No, yeah. but I'm like, y'all don't got any like uglies, like super uglies. Mm. We got a well-rounded group. Of, like, we got ugly guys in our crew. I don't know. No, I don't think. I haven't any, seen everybody. I don't think there's any uglies. We got the same guys. Oh, maybe I haven't seen everybody. Same six to seven guys, max, and they all look. Yeah, you know them all. Well kept. Uh, y'all look what? Well kept. Well kept. Say, man. Well kept, man. I True. Like I feel like that's the most important. Like, <laughs> yeah. At least, be, like, if like, she's not the baddest bitch in the world, like at least have a good now list yeah, outfit be on. Clean. Like, see, that's a pet peeve. When girls come out and they like. I don't really want to go out, so I'm like super dressed down. I'm like, oh, super dressed down. Home. I'd be dressed yeah, down. Yeah, I'd be dressed down too. But you're dressed be, down, be, be looking. Yeah, it's capped. Don't yep. come in the, the joint with Lululemons on. Yeah. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> like, <laughs> Lululemons and like slides and like big ass glasses because you don't want to do makeup. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Me about and Kelly that. will just wear like this. Yeah, that's, yeah, cool. that's yeah. cool. Still capped. Some guys, I've seen girls come in the worst. I'm like, oh, you just want to, you hungry. <laughs> He's hungry. Or you want to go out or something? <laughs> I'm not mad at you, but this don't. We, we, we like to. <laughs> we like to keep our. That's accurate our vibe though, because up. it's like really true though. Like, because I have done that definitely before. Yeah, like, I'm just like, I don't want to hang out with this person, but I'm like, oh, I could definitely use a dinner right now. So not you guys necessarily, but I could use a dinner right now. I'm just gonna go and I'm just gonna go home right after, and I don't care what I look like. Oh I'm yeah, now nah, if you come eat and go home right after, you might never. Get an oh, again. we hate that part. We hate <laughs> that. gets in trouble for that. Like, you, ah. might, you, you might never get invited. Yeah, yeah, I ain't gonna say nothing there. But not you, because we're cool with you. Yeah. But. I do that a lot to people that I don't know because I don't care. You know what yeah. I'm saying? But it's I'm even like, worse because it'll be my guys. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And she'll do it, and, and then, then I all have to hear about it. They're so like, why is your friend? Your friends are rude. She did this and this, and then I have to defend her, and then we get an argument. I'll try to stop it before it happens. Like if you say like, oh, excuse me. If you say like, I'm gonna come eat, and then like. I'm gonna go home after. I'm like, that's all good. You don't gotta go. I'm not gonna let it come. You get there, to dinner, and eat. And then I'm not gonna bounce. tell nobody I'm about to leave. I'm I, gonna can, I can figure the vibe out when you get there. Before Facts. you get there, I can figure the vibe out. Like what you want. Like, I'll say different things. Like uh, I don't know. Uh, we gonna we gonna we gonna leave here at 11:30 to go to the club. And then if she says like some off the wall, I'm like, ah, that's all good. We don't have no space at the table. <laughs> Link tomorrow or something like that. Or you just don't answer. Oh, I don't answer. You've done that to me before. I've, uh, king of don't answer. Luke is a king of don't answer. Yes. I, don't like, I don't really like saying a no. I like to just. Which is ghost. which is that you've done that to me, <laughs> to me multiple times. No, nah, you be taking too long to get ready sometimes. Me? Yes. Yeah, I wrong bitch. I do not take long to get ready. She doesn't. So why, why, very quick. Why would I tell you no? I don't know. Maybe you just. Never. He told you to go home and no. change one time. Huh? Right, that was- oh, yeah, he did. I did. Oh, I did one time. Yeah, it was going somewhere. Come on, really. That was recent. Really? Oh, it was when we was going to Toka, probably. Come it was on, going somewhere. Yeah, we was it going was to, raining. We were going to Toka. Because I didn't know what was going on, and I just came from somewhere. I don't but know. Where they, 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 they Rudy oh texted me. God. I said, ah. Oh yeah, I never that. Well, no, because She's we had. She's like they're not answering. <laughs> I'm like, that's not fucking dick. <laughs> we didn't have no seats at the I table. I couldn't breathe. Oh, we going to Delilah. Oh, we going to Delilah, and Delilah has a strict dress code that I can't. Over overstep sometimes. Mm-hmm. And I had on sweatpants. Yeah, sometimes I could, but the I don't want to give you that type of Yeah, not on Sunday night. I haven't been to the island in a minute. Me either. We go on Sunday. Fuck with us. I have a baby's birthday. You dress? Earlier in the day, though. You got time. Five o'clock. At Delilah? Five o'clock should be over, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, like, how long baby <laughs> birthdays oh, last? Five o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> baby's birthdays don't last that long. They sleep. I can't do baby's birthdays for too long. Yeah, you know, like an hour and a half. Damn, I wish we had some more of these. Y'all have had hella... Ba- we should take a shot, I think. Y'all have had hella baby's birthdays lately. Oh, a lot of people in your group have babies, I feel. Like who? Big fathers. <laughs> <laughs> you got one person in our group that have babies. Uh, what's his oh. name? Mac? Mac Roger? What's ben? his name? Ben. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Ben, Zach. It's someone else. Zach. 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 Yeah. A lot yeah. of them. I feel like you guys ben at BK... That's it. What the, 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 the uncles? Yeah, I'll be a cool uncle for The rich, the rich uncles. Yeah, I'll be there. I'll be there. Hey, you want some uh, toys? I got you. I'll be there. <laughs> I can't toys? pay for it. I can't pay for formula and diapers. I can pay for the cool stuff they like. I'll be the uncle forever. Hmm. Okay, we're taking the shot. Do we have watch yes. glasses? Until she come back around. Yeah. A shot of what? This- Either Hennessy or Jose Cuervo. I can't do Hennessy. I'll take a shot of Hennessy. I will too. Are you serious? serious? That Jose Cuervo. I would rather do that than Jose Cuervo. I, no, I, do, can't I, do I, I ain't doing Hennessy. I have Jose to do the Jose Cuervo. Hennessy. Can you reach anything? You're on the okay. 
Um, I know you guys, you know, obviously have celebrities coming to your store all the time, but has there ever, even at the beginning, or probably not now, but at the beginning, was there any celebrities that, the you've, cups been, too, please. that you've been, like, Thanks. starstruck by or, like, nervous for? Starstruck? Um, when we first got out here? Um, like, someone that came by the store and you were like, oh, my God. Let me see. Like, really star- I don't really get starstruck, really. Even when you first moved to LA? Are you taking one? Oh, yeah. Nah, Which, when, what, I, when I was in... I think I would only get starstruck. In Virginia, I was... One um, person. Who? I was like really cool with Chris Brown, Rihanna? like Kobe. Oh, oh that's different. Yeah. Kobe, wow. Oh, oh. yeah. We drinking, drinking. She lit off that Corona already. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just not very strong. I've been doing solid core, trying to get oh stronger, but I'm just weak. Weak link. If I drink this, that means I'm outside tonight. Yes. You already said you were before you only came got, in here. Only got one. Um, I'm going home. One speed. I'm not going home. I'm all Ubered here. <laughs> and he dressed. <laughs> he Ubered here and he's dressed. And he's all ready outfit. to go. So, I mean, I'm if home. I'm gonna be on camera, what you want me to be? Bummy? We're going yes. on we're going on a double date after this. Oh, yeah, <laughs> tell, you, tell, tell, you, tell your tell your niggas that uh, we friends. Bestie. They hate it. They'll hate it. Well. Salute. Oh my god, this is fucking Hennessy. Mm-hmm. Oh, I could drink Henny. Henny and Corona. Actually, Henny you talk? Oh no. Nah. You guys are wiling I'm out. About to slam somebody. Henny and Corona is a crazy combo. It's my, it's my roots. Yeah. Oh, don't, don't, don't forget where you roots. came from. True. At ODU, I was fucking, I was walking around with this. I was drinking, drink. what is the thing? Mad Dog. This Mad Dog. Kind of, this College. Kind of, I used to have the personal one. You know the one the bottle is like oh. flat. The small one. Uh, yes, put it in my too. back pocket. Savage, I'll man. have that in a backwood. I never did bucket. that. I never did Hennessy, but Mad Dog, I would take over. You never Henny in college? No. What were you drinking? Mad Dog. That's it? Mad and, Dog? Tito's. and Tito's. Tito's, oh, Tito's. yes. I was heavy on Tito's. Tito's and lemonade was my fucking shit. Some, some ODU stuff. Yeah, Tito's. Yeah. Like, Tito's is like Everyone the, drank Tito's. Tito's like the frat drink. I was yeah. vodka cran yeah. all handle, the day. A handle. Vodka I used to drink for Charlotte in college, too. And you know what else I used to drink? Jungle juice. Me too. Everyone I never did, I never did the jungle Nobody juice. Nobody knew what it was. Never, never, never too many, too many stories. I, I used to make my own. They probably uh, put Molly in that bitch. Uh, they too many put, stories. No, couldn't couldn't risk that. it. I just mixed hella different alcohols. It was Honestly, you used to pregame in college so much. Oh, I like, no, pregame was the best part. That's the best part still yeah. to this day. And I think I, Honestly, I would the mix everything. Would be the best part. Back then, I would just I would be like, okay, tequila shot, great. Vodka shot, great. Oh, yeah. Beer, everything. What was that? I used to wake up. Destroyed. Biggest headaches. Destroyed. Like, I still I used to wake up and do it again, though. It's yeah, like, fact. now if I tried that. I would throw up <laughs> yeah. and it's then over. wake up. Now and we still I'd do it sometimes. No, no, no. I don't mix no, nothing. No, we do. Now. Yeah, we still oh. go out and no, 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 be her mixing and everything. No, we don't no, do that. I can't the last that. time I threw up from drinking was when I got Yeah, we drink. <laughs> when we drink heavy, like, if we do drink, we'll, like, like drink a lot socially. Like, a lot of tequila shots, shots, shots. Still a lot. Is like, so I always eat before. Yeah. But I feel like what, I, what I can't do anymore is drink for a long ass time. Like if I start at 3 p.m., I can't go all night. Like I cannot go all night. I got I about like I was four like, hours. S- Saturday, they got mad I went home. I was like, bro, we've been out for six hours. Yeah, like, so like I'm done. Then sometimes mm-hmm. we be trying to have civil like dinners and gatherings before we go out, but we make that. No, it's never civil. It's impossible. Yep, I'm civil. I, if I'm trying to have a civil dinner with y'all, I just hear, shut up. Rudy, who, shots who, up. And who's screaming it? Him! <laughs> Shot o'clock. Rudy, shots up. Shots uh, up. I'm trying, to, I'm trying to have fun. But that's us at any dinner, Rudy. Yeah, y'all do yeah. that too, regardless. We do that. No, y'all no matter where we go. You guys just bring something out of me that's just like, woo, let's fucking go. Let's fucking take out the shots. Sometimes place. you won't even say shots up. The shots will just come out. But Thanks. wait, I, 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 like I was trying to get somewhere with this question. Right, I'm on, a starstruck yeah. question. Oh, yeah. Starstruck? And my point being was... I seen a video of when Tiana Trump came in, Ooh, <laughs> and she looked at you like she looked at you like I'm trying to. I was like, "Whoa, I know we got butterflies right now." <laughs> nah, nah. I've seen that. I've seen that look before. <laughs> you see that look often, huh? I see that look often. Not from a demon like that. That's what I'm saying. A demon, an iconic porn star that everybody. You know what I'm saying? Like. Yeah, I mean. He's blushing. He's <laughs> blushing. He's blushing. <laughs> I'm not blushing. I'm just trying to uh, find the right things to say. Um, yeah, she was staring at me like she wanted to eat me alive. Yeah, she I does. guess it was um, it was a weekend, weekend evening. I don't know what she wanted had planned, but she called cool, though, cool people. Mm-hmm. After I got to know her, political answer. Me. Political? <laughs> nah, I did not. <laughs> never got the fucking head from Tiana Trump or. I never didn't ask that. I'm just asking. I'm just <laughs> putting it out there. She just called cool, cool people. Hmm. Okay. Also, what Drake is having. Five shows in LA. Yeah. In the, Ooh, all in one month. Crazy. I'm like, has anyone ever done that before? Like, that's crazy to me. He's has Tell five us shows back yeah. And they're all going to be sold out. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and the tickets are like $800 each. Imagine. He should have just done it at like SoFi, though. He did. Three of them are at SoFi. No, yeah. it's not. Yeah. It's Forum. 
Oh, All SoFi is the stadium. Kia, no, no, uh, no. Two of them are at Kia. Kia is the forum. Kia is the forum. And then the rest are at SoFi. No, the rest are at Crypto. Oh, you're right, you're right, you're right. SoFi right. is the football stadium. Okay, yeah, yeah. Crypto Where the weekend had his. SoFi is huge. Yeah, but yeah. I feel like he should have done that. Yeah, and then that you could have one less day, too. Like two less days. Five shows is oh. And they would have been cheaper. Five shows, for more revenue. Yeah, more revenue. Yeah, exactly. It's about money at the end of the day. Because it would have been cheaper if he did it at the. The tickets would have been cheaper. Like more people would have been able to come. Definitely. But people are, they're suing him. Why? Right. Ticketmaster or somebody. I think they're suing Ticketmaster. Oh, why? What? I don't know. I didn't, I didn't click the article, I saw but I saw though. the headline. Ticketmaster probably tried to come up. Like, For the pr- ticket prices? Yeah. Man, that shit was OD. I looked no, at no. that joint. I mean, I'm not going, but I was just looking it up because everybody's We're complaining going, about sure. it. We're going, for sure. We're going to find a way. We're what going July? all five nights. What is August. It? August? That's far. Your birthday. You want to hear the same songs five days in a row? Yeah. I'm going to go twice, maybe. Yeah, because it's gonna. he's going to bring out different people. I need to go once. All the blends going to be in that joint, so. So I'm going. So where are you going? I'm going because I like music. I'm good on blends. <laughs> are we are we blends? Are y'all blends? Yeah, what is what is yeah, blends? Yeah, we're blends too. Oh, you huh? guys are? We're blends. I'm not a blend. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. A blend, what are you talking a blend is about? not a... Uh, it's not a derogatory term. It's not at all. It's not. It's like a word of endearment, actually, because we don't say bitch and hoe. Like or a lot like, of okay. guys say. It's like another way of saying like girls. <laughs> yeah. So, a lot of guys so you guys aren't blends. That's why I said I'm no, not, we're not blend. blend. I don't know what he, I don't know what he was trying Honestly, to say right there, blend, but no, but I'm not a blend. We're like, you know, a part of the mix. Like, oh, you know what dudes be like, like, where the hoes at? I hate that one guy said. I don't like saying hoes. Like, where the blends at? Yeah, mm. where the hoes at sound like. They literally mean hoes. Like, is she fucking? Oh, no, true. no, I don't mean it like that, but. That's how, that's how guys are. Where the hoes, where the hoes at? You're saying like, where's the cool girls? Yeah, where's Where the girls? Are the Those girls are pretty. They might Where's bust it down just like them little hoe girls. Oh, you see a good looking girl? Oh, you see a girl in general? You think she look good? Dang, that blend is OD. Yeah. Mm. It's OD. not derogatory. Like, it's not a bad term. Some people be like, I'm not a blend. I'm like, I'm, I'm not a blend. Have you guys been saying that since college? Or yeah, I've been saying it forever. Are you serious? <laughs> yeah. It used to be mixed girl, but we changed it to every girl. That's us. Yeah. Yeah. Blend. We're the originals. Original mixed girl. We're the first ones ever born. <laughs> original yes. blend, I'm saying. Original blendini. <laughs> blendini brown. That's what that's what it was it was called. It's a mixture. But now we're gonna just like, you know, it's for everybody. <laughs> what type of music do you guys like to have sex to? Um Pillow Talk playlist. Yeah. What's that? You actually know. put on a playlist before? I just put it on. I like, know. He like turns on like, I know it's all slow songs. Burr, burr, burr. <laughs> yeah, I'll be like, I like Hold on, let me get this together. I like to play the weekend. If I put on music, I'm, Sometimes you don't get to. Exactly. Yeah. Sometimes I feel like you yeah. time. Netflix. Alexis, you better get the yeah, TV. Or the Netflix. TV's on. Yeah. But like yeah. if I was to put on music, it's just like, I would just go to a playlist. It's mm. on Apple Music. I just feel like the stereo- I don't have time to put a playlist exactly. together. It's already, it's already, it's already a made on, playlist. <laughs> I, I Stay put, right there. <laughs> I would, like that. Like, yeah, I, would, I would put it on before we even uh, come yeah, in the room. Yeah, yeah. Like it's on. Right, it's, it's examples. Like if it, if it's planned, like if I know we about to do something, I'm gonna put it on a long playlist so I have time for you to relax and I can. True. It is still it still on. It has to be very long. While have, have a sec. Like, yeah. like trilogy the whole Album. weekend. I need all. No, 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 no. I don't we need one artist. Perfect. I need the artist. Yeah, to one one trilogy is the weekend. No, I, I agree with you. Mookie. No, no, one I'm artist. I don't agree. Oh, you not listen to artists? No, no. I mean, that's why I say it's a playlist. You know, uh, multiple different vibes. Okay. <laughs> no, I like I like the songs. It's right though. because you gotta keep the. And I think weekend is the perfect choice. Yeah, keep the vibe up. It's but, good, it's slow. It's, I don't like the weekend like <laughs> me that. Me either. I, I would have put me on party next door or something like that. I think party next door. That's better. Slow, like stereotypical, like sexy songs. Like it's that's kind of too much. It. I can't. Yeah. Put, I even though my uh, you know Trey my my brother, I'm not putting panty drop no. off rip. No, no, no. What about like NBA Young Boy? I was what? Like, I get I like more like <laughs> yeah. hood scary music during that. Sometimes I don't care. I just be putting on whatever hood like scary music. the like, first play, I, the first like album I might have just downloaded like, boom, put on go. <laughs> cuz you cuz you're in a rush trying to you know, sometimes you don't want to stop the mood. My like, last my last downloaded album was freaking the Hannah Montana soundtrack. So I'm what? like I got to make sure but it's usually Netflix anyways. That's usually what's playing anyway. Or Rain Sounds. Yes. Rain sounds. <laughs> you gotta set that up though. Over there meditating. You gotta My set it up. My whole Apple Music is rain sounds, bro. I can't sleep without it. <laughs> on the fly is hard though. On the fly is hard because you never know what might happen. Well, in my 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 experience, anything can happen at any moment. Yeah, you just yell, yeah. Alexa, play something. True. They might need an Alexa. That's my tip. Get a, get Alexa. That's true. That would yeah. be so much easier. I bought one. I don't know what I did with it. Yeah, you can say it real silently. <laughs> you lost be. her. Yeah. Did. How much how much time do you think should be spent with your significant other? Like if it's your boy, if it's your girlfriend, how much time do you think you should be with each other? Like, how many times? Like, live together or don't live together. What if they live in a different city? 
If you live in the same city, but you don't same live together. Same city? Don't live together? Damn, I've never dated someone in the same city. Me either. Uh, I would say four, four to five times a week. Is five, that too much? Four to five days out of the week? Uh, yeah. Sleeping over or just being around or sleeping, each other? Yeah, sleeping over or being around each other. Yeah, two days apart. Three day, two days Yeah, but I like my space, so the two days, yeah, I definitely need like so. at least two days to myself. I love my space. I'm clingy, though. I like I'm to be clingy. with the girl I like often. I feel like, yeah, every day. But it's Every need, day? But I think if you can. <laughs> I think it's needed, though. <laughs> I if can't do mature. every day. I'm sorry. <laughs> I can do every day if you're cool. Like, uh, we could, <laughs> you wouldn't be dating if you're cool. cool. No, if like, you're a cool girl, I'll do it every day. No, like if you have, like for example, like we can hang out and go out to eat dinner on date night sometime. You could cook sometime. We could watch a movie. Someday I could be here playing a game. You just doing whatever on your phone. That's cool. And we're with each other, but we're not really engaging the whole mm. time. Like a friend vibe. You just in the presence. Not. Yeah, I'm around you. Like if you need, yeah, if, you, exactly. if you're hungry, you tap me on the shoulder. I'm on the phone or on the computer or playing a game or. Text right, if you niggas. can just chill. Yeah, like we don't There's have to There's a lot of space in the house. You just go way over there. You Literally. go over there, do your own thing. We're still with each other though. Literally, so. I don't really play the game when I'm with somebody. It's too hard too. It's too hard. To get to like, I appreciate you. <laughs> I don't know why girls get mad about that. I don't know. When, it's, mad? when it's when it's I don't get mad about that for hours and hours and hours and hours. That's when it's problem. If you only have a certain amount of time with that person, yes, that's rude. Damn. But even like if, if you're coming, let's say I'm visiting you for you for a weekend other, or something. Even if you live with each other, it's like no, no, no. If we live together, if we together, live together, I'm playing the game. Yeah, no, no. I'm not saying don't play the game. I'm saying when you're playing it for hours, all night, all day, all night, that gives me time to go do something. Yeah, like I'm saying, like, she must have PTSD. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Look, look how I mad do. she got. Yeah. I fucking do. That shit made me so like, for example, fucking irritated. Yeah, I, I've been there before. When you're like, I'm playing the game for Mad Long. We play the game all the time. That's all we do. We play the game for countless hours. And maybe she's bored, but if I'm not here playing the game, what, what you gonna do anyway? You'll be just on your phone scrolling regardless. Oh, paying attention to each other. Like what? Talking what? We could talk. If you live together, that's OD though. Yeah, if you have to get us Like, I would go fucking just live my life. B. So you wouldn't mind if he's on the game all night till 5 o'clock in the morning. Oh, what, every what, day. But what time did he get on the game? I don't know. I'm just saying. Hours, if, we got, if I got in the five, game at 10. A day, I don't want to be with I'm, a man who's spending five or six hours out of his day playing a fucking video True. Well, like, it's not attractive at no. some point. Yeah. I mean, if, I he, it, mean. I mean, if he's broke. What if y'all went to dinner, morning? movie, yeah. and then he went home and played the game? Was that a problem? All night? Yeah. I'm too much to sleep. If I have nothing to do the next day. And they're all online, and we're all awake. We're probably we'll probably play the game till four. Yeah. No four, way. Yeah. <laughs> like if I take you out, it's five of us on the headset. We're all like playing the game together. Yeah, literally. And I can talk to you behind. I can hear you still. It's we, like we you and all ate. your girlfriends doing something <laughs> I can together. Hear you still. I can hear you. We already <laughs> ate. Went to the movies. We had sex. We talked about our problems. There's not more left for today. Do you, do, do you do the little checkup? Like like if you have a pause in the game, you take off the yeah. Headset, yeah always. Like, I'll take it like, off. Yeah, I'll, I'll mute my mic. I'll mute. Yeah. Put my headset up. Yo, you good? Da da da. All right. I'll be like. <laughs> I'll, I'll probably go watch a movie in the room. You would stay up to five a.m. waiting for him to get off. Yes, get you would stay up the whole time. My ass. Oh, what? what? What are you waiting for? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> exactly. So snap on him when he gets off. Patiently uh -oh. waiting for hours, building it up. Damn, you crazy. I was sitting in bed watching the movie Amsterdam. Yeah, watch the movie. I do for a while. After a while, it's like, all right, bro. Like I'm. It's five a.m. You should have been asleep at like two. <laughs> Yeah, like you should go to sleep. Like, what else are you doing? Are you if, if you have you horned or somewhere or, or you want him to like touch on you? Just tell him he would. I'm sure he can put the game away for a second and then come back to it. Y'all don't understand what's like. I understand. <laughs> I've been there. I understand too. So I don't cut the game on. So I don't even want to run into those problems. Thank you. You cut the game on. You know? No. You blame with you? No. When? I've seen her. Yeah, I've heard. Yeah, yeah, but but it'd be like an hour. But right, I gotta go. You gotta go. It's, it's hard. It's hard. It's hard, hard to play. It's hard to focus. You gotta refocus on the game, and then we'll yell at you like, "What are you doing?" Because <laughs> we don't know what you got going on over there. So right, I'm gonna. Because once you mute the mic, you mute the mic, and then you, you start doing some bullshit, and you y'all not communicating. <laughs> And I'm the king. I will be like spaz through the headset, like, "Yo, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> like, Why are you watching over there? <laughs> what game y'all be playing? 2K. Yeah, that's uh, well. I so, love like, 2K. You I'm have, really good at 2K. You have to play. Yeah, you so have to be locked in on that. Yeah. Right. 2K is hard as fuck to play defense on, though. Yeah, it's Bro, not. I be stressed. It's not like a kid game no more. It's like competitive, so I need my time. So that, you're right. Yeah, sometimes. <laughs> it's not that's why I already hang with girls serious. after. Like I don't even hang out with girls one on one. Hmm. Like just just regular, just chilling. But I feel like you always seem like you want to. Like you're always like, oh, so single. Aww. I don't, I don't, I don't. Does it feel like more of a task to hang out with romance. a girl by herself? I'm looking for romance. Yeah, I mean, you're I looking like, for romance, but you don't hang out with girls one on one. Because it's misleading. Because I know they don't want to. Mm. Just, they they doing their own thing all the time too. It's pointless. Maybe it's the girls that you are attracting. Maybe. 
Maybe I don't know. I'm attracted to a lot of <laughs> a lot of different type of girls. Hmm. I don't know. Indecisive. I mean, some girls are cool, but some like, hey, I rather hang on alone. I like my space. I like a long time after working all day. You said every like, day. I said five days. Yeah, five school. Five days. Four is preferably. Four, yeah, four. Five one, school. One or two to hang with the homies, or one. Other other two days, face time all day. Yeah, we'll talk That's every true. day. True. Yeah, I talk to you every day. Yeah. But I like not living in the same city as the person, though. I hate it. Oh, I like it because like my my love language is physical touch. Yeah, yeah. I like I need it. To be Why do you like that? Are yeah. you? Uh, are you, do you think he would step out on you or something? What you do want you mean? your? Oh, you want your space? Yeah, I think a lot of girls space. say I like the. Oh, I'm not talking to a guy in L. A. I'm be talking to someone outside. I'm like that nigga probably could do worse. I mean, they still sure. to the guy in L. A. But I've tried. I've dated guy. guys here, but I've yeah. tried. But it's just like I don't know. I don't know why I can never find a guy here. Like it always. I, I don't want to be long like twice. Every too. time I find somebody no, that too. I'm talking to for real, they're not here. You're just not giving them the same benefit of the doubt. You just see them often, so you think they're. Worse than the that's other true. guy that's not, you can't see. That's very true. Yeah. When yeah. I'm around someone a lot, maybe I get annoyed by them easier. Mm-hmm. If I'm not around them, I don't get annoyed as easy. Yeah. But then it's like, okay, what if Sunday we can be together? And then I'm like, oh, I don't actually like you like I thought I did. Yeah, you got you to gotta, you gotta be with someone often. That's why I don't go on little dates one-on-one. I like group settings so I can see how you are before I take you on date one-on-one because it could be like embarrassing. Before you could embarrass me at the table. Yeah, you might mm. be weird. I might just waste time to get, get to know you really, let you know. Like secrets and I'm like a serial thing. going on dater. Like I go on hella dates with so many. I'm not like that, but like I like yeah. like going on dates. You know what I mean? But I no problem like, going with a one on one. I stick myself into bowling, s- movie. <laughs> it don't gotta be dinner. Bowling, bowling. <laughs> I, movie. I get myself into a lot of situations where I'm like, now I'm hanging out with a fucking weirdo, and I don't know how to get. Yeah, out yeah, I don't yeah, understand exactly. how Rudy goes on so many dates because she's annoyed by everyone. Exactly. So yeah. I'm like, how the fuck? Girls like going on one on one dates. Like Ten that. minutes in, I'm like, I will never. Because girls person. don't like always being around your friends. Yeah, or girls don't want to be around. I don't. I don't go on a lot of dates because I'm just like everyone's whack to me. So I'm like, I, I, if I like someone, I'll go on a date. But I'm not gonna just go on a date for fun. But, but she doesn't. Oh yeah, no. How will you get to know them if you don't go on a date? You get. You I feel like I would them. know if I want to go on a date before I go on the date. What if you yeah. never met yeah. them? I would know. Group setting. With mutual friends. If you never met them, you can tell if you like them or not. Yeah. yeah, I mean, I you, you could know some check. You have a checklist yeah, in your head. Exactly. Of how they move, of what you see, and then you can buy them to If they have situation. things that I like about them, then maybe I will, but. Mm. Yeah, dating one on one is, especially in this city, is. Because yeah. I don't like small talk. Like, yeah, it's that's part of the, Exactly, so I don't know how you do that. I, I, that's I what I'm shocking. Into, I jump shocking straight into it. I'm not like, oh, so. Well, are you, <laughs> like, are you like the person like with the meme, like, don't text me what you're doing, ask yes. me for a vacation? Literally, take me to Paris. I see no, some of the girls post that. I'm like, what? I don't like sm- like what? I don't like that. Like I we just have if either we're talking if we're not together, like we're talking about our day or something, or we're talking about the next time we're gonna hang out or see yeah, each other like or fly time. to each other I or hate, go somewhere. Yeah, when they're like, "What's up? How was work?" I'm like, "Bro, uh, do you want to like hang cringing. out or do you not want to hang out?" I'm like, out? "Shut up! What do you mean how was work?" But if they're not in your city, you have to have that. Yeah, but how was work? Like, yeah. shut up. He's, no, trying, no, he's no. trying to keep your interest. He's trying to keep your no, interest. No, no, no. He probably don't care how it's work. He's trying send to keep Send me something like, funny. but it's a conversation. Send me like a funny meme or that, like, yeah, that exactly. gets incorporated within the convo too. That's why Instagram is easier for the no. numbers. Instagram, you We're can share memes and like stories. Talking on Instagram. Or just like There's no FaceTime. way I'm fucking talking to someone on Instagram all day. There's no, no way. I mean, not like that, but if you first get to know someone, the best no, way is to that. communicate through Instagram. Or you can just... Because I think it screams that the guy's not serious about you, and it's like, at this point in my life, I want to be in something serious, so I'm like, what? why would I do that? He can be serious. The guy that gets your phone number is... Some guys all have the same material True. motive. They're just trying to get something. In my mind, Instagram is just not real. Like, it's real, but it's like, if we're DMing all the time, that's not real, you know? Yeah. Like, we I have to be, that. like, texting or Until you get to know him. Until you get to know him. To me, that means you have a girlfriend. If we're snapping yes. or we're DMing, it means you're married. You're married. You're fucking married. <laughs> you're married. You're fucking married. <laughs> you have a family. You're married. You have a family. You have four so, kids. I don't know. Guys are sicker. Guys yeah. are sick with that. Girls. Oh. Everyone I mentioned Vanish is crazy. BK just posted a meme that said, um, I know I know people that live with their girl and still cheat. I'm like, oh, do y'all know people that do that? I don't yes. Know. Not me, I don't know who be. You know people that do that. That I'm live, asking them. Oh. That live with someone and cheat. I, I do know people that do that. Exactly. How? I know. I know. What do you mean how? how? how do Actually, you I know guys that do that. I like that, but I don't know them personally. Oh, how do you get There's away with it? I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I couldn't do it. Vanish mode and they pay. There's hush, people that live with their money. wives and have apartments. Yeah, that's true. Apartments, hush money, girls are scandalous. They'll or they'll go out of town and bring them. 
Yeah, if or you, they'll if you have a job, anything, in the if car, you have a job where sprinter. you where you get to go out of town often, aka athletes, mm-hmm. you can do it so easily because it's like. Yeah, you can do it. It's easy. Yeah. It's easy to do it. Like it's easy. Yeah, it's super easy. Well, not for well basketball players. The football players don't have as much. Leadership. Yeah, they they have to get yeah. stuck in the fucking hotel. Yeah. Y'all can't even leave. Damn. Or have anyone in there. We football leave. players on lockdown. We can leave. We can leave for a few. <laughs> but we only get like two, three hours. Like we get more. It's, it's, it's trash. Yeah. And yeah. then you couldn't go sleep over at a girl's house, or a girl can't come sleep exactly. over too. Exactly. Uh, no, that's been. They got the security sitting right there on the floor. Right. So exactly. as you come out that elevator, they got cameras. At both ends of the hallway. Like, NBA players are flying girls into every yeah, city. And like they, the NBA players right. can do whatever the fuck they, they want. They can go out to the club until 6 a.m. and then and go then to go, the game. Exactly. Yeah, literally. They, they can miss you around and still play. I'll be yeah. flying places. Girls be like, you can't do this. I'm like, no, nope, I got curfew at 10. We got meetings at 7. Football got, players like, are like, structured. Sure. Like, what you want me to do? I wonder why that is. Maybe it's because it's more of y'all. No, but nah, we, we play at 1, we play play at 1 p.m. That's why games are at night. Sometimes they play at 12 sometimes. That's on the weekends. So? What's the difference? It just... It right. still it's wake still up early. 12. But they still 12, have to wake up early. Yeah, like us is wake up. The first bus leaves at... 8. I think it's because it's a lot of you and yeah. it's like hard uh, to keep track. And our track. bus leaves at 8.15. If all of you guys yeah. went out, it would be a fucking shit show. It would be like yeah. collecting a whole bunch of little kids. Like, all right, guys. Yeah. <laughs> a basketball league. And, a basketball league. Like, it's like 12 like, players yeah. on basketball. Football is way more physical than basketball. Yeah, you like, I can't go get fucked up and then go hit... A motherfucker running full like, speed the next day. Or basketball, like they can go out till six a.m. and drop thirty the next day. Yeah, yeah. like so basketball. Easily, yeah. And they're it's, a little, their it's a little easier on your body. Yeah. yeah so for easy. those of you who don't. Speaking know, of no, speaking of this because this is argument all already, the time. I already know. She, no, I already know what you're about to ask. I have ask to too. bring this up because <laughs> sorry, Mo is the good, walking poster child for this argument, and he just doesn't agree with me. Mm. Like you're the walking poster child for that. NBA is easier. Not no, not easier. NBA is harder to play, and you have to be more athletic to be in the NBA than the NFL. You're the walking poster child for that. I don't understand. You're literally the example of that's. And I said argument. both are equally as hard. Yeah, they're both hard. I don't. I would agree. say so, I, I would say basketball is more skill based. Right, but you have to be more athletic to play basketball because you have to have so many different skills. Like you have to be able to have move your feet and hand eye coordination and shoot and mm-hmm. defend. But and you got to be able to move your feet in football. Yeah, I think wait, I'd wait. Be more athletic. Can we not everybody first, does. Can we say almost every position who, except quarterback? For the people who don't know, Mo played college basketball and it's now in the NFL. Is there anyone? It else? It's literally insane. Is there anyone insane. else that's ever okay. done that before? Uh, yes, yeah, like not eight, many. eight or nine. Yeah, not eight many. or nine out of like two million yeah, people. Out of a yeah. Lot, yeah. Yeah. That's insane. It is crazy. But, yeah, like, think about it. Say, okay, whatever. I don't even know the story. Maybe you can tell it. But, like, say the Lakers called you and were like, okay, we want you to come for a workout when you're at VCU. You would clearly pick the workout with the VCU than the fucking Indiana, whatever, Colts. Oh, duh. I was exactly. playing basketball at the time. Exactly. Yeah. So that's why most people that choose football, like, weren't probably as or good enough to make to the NBA. Yeah. Maybe. So that's why the argument's just... It's it would have been it would have been like a harder path if that exactly. makes sense. Exactly, and there's a lot of like you know basketball. You got the G League, but you don't make no money right, in the G League. Right, right. So it's like, just a better business. You got overseas, decision. but I was I ain't going overseas. Like nine, you probably knew football was more of a guarantee. Leave, leaving for nine months. Now I honestly didn't decide to play football till like halfway through my senior year. Yeah, no, year. they you literally played college basketball, and now you're in the NFL. What position do you play in the NFL? Tight end. And do you start? Yeah. This man starts in the NFL at tight end and play college basketball. Yeah, for that. Yeah, for that right. like, but, but it, it took comes, me a while to start, though. Yeah, it comes from okay, the athletic. That's yeah, he's insane, athletic, though. though. But the thing about football, 100%, the like, thing about football starting is like a rel- like not really. Sure. Like three of y'all. Like, except but regardless, unless you're, the you're not on the practice squad. Like you're on the yeah. actual team. Yeah, I only did practice squad for one year. How long have you been in the NFL? I'm going on year seven now. Exactly. Damn. Do you understand how insane that is? No, that would crazy. never happen in 29. football. Oh. Imagine everyone, someone playing football their whole life, just grinding, trying to make it to the NFL. And then you're just like, oh. and Mo just walks in there like, like I'll play, I guess. They I'll say, play, I guess. They say, they, say, they say it to me all the time. Like, Since you guys called, I'll play. If you, it don't Since you guys pulled my arm, my arm I, I might guess. as well. Might, might as well, well. shit. Come all right. I'll give it a try. Only if it were that simple. I was honestly about to stop playing football at one point. Okay, but it was that simple, though. It like obviously simple. you had to put in the work, but it was that simple. They called you. Didn't wait. Tell the story. They called you because you were in the final four or something. Somebody no, was like, "All right, let's go." Um, how'd it go? My freshman year, Coach Smart knew the scout for the Eagles. Mm-hmm. His name was Mike Davis. Came. He was just watching practice, and then they called me over. And then he was like, "This is Mike Davis, Eagles." And he's like, "Yeah, that's what they look like." I'm like, "What are they talking about?" They're like, "Yeah, that's what like tight ends in the NFL yeah. look like. My body type." Right. 
at that point, I'm straight out of high school. Football is a lot more, yeah, whatever. Fuck NFL. Yeah. Like, yeah. That's the last so years go by, and then my one of my college coaches was best friends with Jason Witten. Yes. Tight end for the Cowboys. I don't know if y'all know who that is. But um, <laughs> one of the best like, yes. tight ends of all yes. time, literally. Like, really. Totally so love that guy. He came, love him. <laughs> he came to our game, but everyone like assumed he was coming to watch me play. Like, no, he was visiting his friend. But right. that, that took a, a whole life of its own. Yeah, Went to the NCAA yeah. tournament. Everyone was talking about that. So then the next year, NFL teams were coming up. All my basketball games, literally. NFL and NBA, because NBA teams are hitting me up too. Right. So I'm like, bro, I'm 6'6". Six, six. They still got me playing in the post. Like, yeah. I'm not going to the NBA playing this position. Yeah. So by the time I was done, I was like, yeah, let me try to play football. First team to call me was the Ravens. Wanted me to play left tackle. I was like, I'm not leaving football. I mean, not leaving basketball to go play left tackle. Play line. Yeah. Like, line so, is that bag, though. Yeah, True. they do. But if I did it again, I'll probably play DN instead of tight That's smart. But... Um, and then yeah, had a pro day. Thirty teams came to my pro day. I didn't. I trained only trained for seven days because I was still in school. I was getting my master's degree, so trained for seven days. Had a pro day. Thirty teams came, which they said some colleges only get thirty teams. Days. I didn't even know that. Like me, I'm just like I don't know the process. I'm just going through the process. This is crazy. And then flew to like ten teams, and then I only chose. I chose Indiana because. Oh, you had to pick. I got to pick. I was a free agent. I because I did five years in college. It was like some rule. I didn't have. I didn't enter the draft. Yeah. Mm. If I entered the draft, I probably would have got drafted, but... That would have been even crazier. Yeah. <laughs> but the thing is, the year before, like a year before, um, during the NFL draft, they were talking about me. Literally. Literally. It was crazy. Like, I was asleep one day. My phone is going crazy. I'm like, yo, what the hell? I'm thinking I got in trouble. Like, my phone's just ringing off the hook. Everyone's sending me the video. I'm like, yo, that's wild. It's crazy. Not even in, in a draft. And I didn't even... That's crazy. Still wasn't even thinking about football at this time. So then, yeah, what... Long story short, signed with the Colts. Taught, you, me, taught you, me football for a year and then... That's I, crazy, though. That's like, did you ever me. play football? Because I just remember you in the gym as Cardinals when we were oh, young. Oh, yeah, basketball. Um, yeah, that was when I stopped playing football. Mm. I played football third grade until ninth grade. I started playing basketball in, like, eighth So that's, grade. like, irrelevant. Because it's, like, you're... Yeah, that's irrelevant. That's literally... That's irrelevant. Everyone yeah. plays that. Literally. Like, I didn't play... After my freshman year, I didn't play football again until the NFL. Which is, that is which is why. <laughs> like, y'all, y'all knew each other when you were in elementary school, right? Yeah. Middle school? You and middle school. Middle school. No, was, elementary school. Was, Wait, I don't you, know. You was in middle school. I was in high school. Yeah. What was Kelly like when she was in middle school? She was a dork? Was she, I mean, cool? she was a hooper. She was good. <laughs> she was a bucket. Yeah. She was a bucket. I was a bucket. She I was, was a bucket. Cool. Kelly, Kelly was nasty. <laughs> I was cool. Bucket and cool. <laughs> she was fucking up the middle schoolers. I was fucking up the middle schoolers. You was. <laughs> I really was. I was. In high school. I wasn't like weird and... She was I wasn't cool. weird. She was ever. cool people. In middle school, you were cool? Yeah. I was weird. I feel like also playing basketball as a girl who's pretty. Not saying I'm pretty. You are. You, pretty. Are. <laughs> you said it. <laughs> I'm not saying that. So I'm not saying so that about myself. I'm not saying that. But it's like people are automatically like, oh, you know what I'm saying? Because it's just normal for girls to look different when they play basketball. Yeah. So yeah. people are automatically like, oh, that's Kelly the basketball girl. Yeah. Like I've been Kelly the basketball girl my whole entire life until I moved here. Yeah. So yeah. Did you play on Coach Courtney's team, right? Yeah. yeah Coach in college. Yeah. I mean, in high school. Actually, yeah. Not in college. Wait, did Coach King coach you? <clears throat> Me? Nah. Oh. He was coaching He was coaching Tracy, you know. But he coached boys sometimes. Yeah, he ain't coached me. But he coached me. Yeah. <laughs> he was a great coach. I like Coach Doug and this dude, Coach Robinson. All these All right. coaches, watch this video and shout out to you guys <laughs> for creating shout some Shout out to you guys. Athletes. Mom Vernon area. Athletes. Athletes. Yeah, Nova. Oh, and Coach Nova. Terry. Coach Nova. Terry. I love Coach Terry. Coach Terry's cool as shit. Oh, I miss Coach Terry. He still oh, hits, he hits me up from time to time. Wait, where did you play in high school? What? I went to South County. I was going to say, you went to the then, the green and white school. Yeah, South County. I remember South County. I went to South County 9th grade and 11th grade. I, I remember Mount Vernon, moved 10th grade. for some reason, because wasn't South County a new school? No, no, no. It was my, the first year it opened, I was there 7th grade. Oh, okay. I it remember. Because South County is 7th through 12th. Yeah. Well, yeah, the I first year it was that. open, it was 7th through 11th. They had no seniors. Hmm. What? It was a new school. It was weird, bro. <laughs> the seniors because they would have to pluck all yeah. the seniors from other, other schools, schools in the county, uh, and they didn't want to leave their schools. Uh, so, it was weird, but I remember when that school opened. Yeah, 7th through 11th, there. they went no games. Their first winning basketball season was when I got there. Oh, sick. Like, they won three games a year before I got there. <laughs> it was crazy. Bro, I feel like that's how Mount Vernon was. Then after that, I left and went to private school. Yeah. Private school gets you there. Always. I didn't go to private school and I got there somehow. I mean, it's like, yeah. if I want to go to the NFL, but... It's harder to go D1 from 
public those schools. public but schools. But we were there. like, you know, the Met. Yeah. We were like third in the Met, though. That's yeah. we were like better than private schools. So yeah. like our record, we I don't know, we were like twenty six and one or something like that. So like we were highly ranked. And then AAU was. You I love AAU. That's how I got my exposure. AAU. Me too. All the big teams wanted me, but I didn't leave. I just stayed on Cardinal because I'm like, all my friends are here. So yeah, big like, teams wanted me too, but like, I was Boo like, Williams called me, DC Assault. I had yeah. literally had DC Assault say to my phone, is don't answer. Yeah. Like, stop bothering yeah. me. Yeah. I'm not right leaving there. my team. Yeah. We're, we were Cardinals. <laughs> Cardinals for life. I can't Cards. believe you guys didn't Woo! finish your Corona. So offensive. I, I know. I finished my shot. No, every, no. every episode, we're going to say Corona sponsor. What, we're out of questions? Please. I'm just telling them every episode. It's been an hour and a half, y'all. We need to wrap this motherfucking hang up. Damn. Oh, I'm sweating under these lights. It. It's time to go get crunk. I, mean, I was having fun with y'all. <laughs> it was fun. Shout out to Virginia for creating all of us. Two up, two down. Two up, two down. <laughs> what does that look like on Damn, there? I don't know which way we're supposed to go. This way, this way. <laughs> okay, so that is all. We will see you guys on the next episode. And as always, you'll love it here. That's not it. We promise. <laughs> Fuck! We did this the last time. Okay, okay go, go. Go, 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 go. Okay, that is all. We will see you guys on the next episode. And as always, we promise you'll love it here.